David Epstein, the sports gene, inside the science of extraordinary athletic performance. Are you curious about what gives extraordinary athletes their edge? Step into the world of The Sports Gene, Inside the Science of Extraordinary Athletic Performance by David Epstein, which reveals the crucial role genetics plays in athletic success. Delve into the significance of various factors such as physical traits, body types, skeletal structures, muscle fibers, aerobic capacity, and the astounding effect of genetics on motivation, pain thresholds, and susceptibility to injuries. Explore the overwhelming dominance of East Africans in long-distance running and West Africans in sprinting, as well as the influence of ancestral roots and environmental factors in developing exceptional athletic abilities. This book summary will ignite your curiosity while shedding light on the complexities of the science behind phenomenal sports performance. The Genetic Advantage in Athletic Performance Becoming a top athlete requires hard work and dedication, but having the right genes can give one a head start. Height, for instance, is a critical factor in basketball. Approximately 80% of a person's height can be attributed to genetics. However, no single gene determines height, and even the most comprehensive study could only explain 45% of the variations. In the NBA, being tall is a tremendous advantage as 17% of American men aged 20 to 40 who are over 7 feet are in the league. Shorter players compensate with long Achilles tendons that enable them to jump high and a long arm span that helps with blocking and rebounding. These traits are also largely hereditary. The right body type for sports. The skeletal structure that is beneficial for each sport varies. For long-distance runners, a nilotic body is preferred due to lightness in the torso and long legs. Sprinters benefit from shorter legs because they have less inertia. Successful swimmers have short legs, long arms, and upper bodies. Additionally, ancestry may influence one's body type and its suitability for certain sports. Muscle Fibers and Genetics Our muscle fibers, inherited through our genetics, play a crucial role in determining our athletic abilities. The composition of our muscles is made up of two types of fiber, fast-twitch and slow-twitch. Fast-twitch fibers are responsible for enabling fast, explosive movements, but tire quickly. These types of fibers are advantageous for sprinting or weightlifting. Slow-twitch fibers, on the other hand, have a slower response time but greater stamina, making them more useful in endurance sports. Each of us has different ratios of these fibers, which make us better at certain sports than others, and there is strong evidence that this ratio is inherited. The ratio of fibers in athletes who excel in particular sports can be significantly different than the 50-50 ratio found in most individuals. For instance, long-distance runners may have 80% slow-twitch fibers, while sprinters have 75% fast-twitch fibers in their calf muscles. Additionally, our genes play a vital role in determining the response of muscles to weight training, fast-twitch fibers grow at twice the rate of slow-twitch fibers, making them more responsive to weight training. Studies have also shown that genes determine the maximum size of muscles, keeping in mind that muscles require skeletal support. 5 kilos of muscle, for instance, require 1 kilo of bone for support. Genetic abnormalities can also affect muscle development, as observed in a recent case where an infant was born with well-defined muscles due to the double muscle genetic condition. This genetic condition is similar to the one that causes the unusual muscle growth found in Belgian blue cows. Overall, our inherited muscle fibers greatly impact our athletic abilities and response to weight training. Boosting your athletic performance. Our innate baseline capacity, the volume of blood, and the ability of our blood to carry oxygen greatly impact our aerobic capacity or VO2 max, which is crucial for any athlete's performance. However, studies show that VO2 max can be improved through training at high altitudes, particularly at 6 to 7,000 feet altitude range. 
This training helps the body produce more red blood cells and hemoglobin to carry more oxygen and improve blood flow, ultimately enhancing athletic performance even for those born without a naturally higher VO2 max. The Genetic Influence on Athletic Performance Our genetic makeup has more subtle effects on athletic performance than just muscles and aerobic capacity. Studies reveal that genes determine one's motivation, pain threshold, and susceptibility to injury. Up to 75% of exercise variation relies on genetic disposition as the brain's response to pleasure varies from person to person. Athletes like Pam Reed, who have a strong urge to train, have a genetic advantage over others. Pain threshold is also inextricably linked to genetics, as individuals who are more resilient to pain are more likely to continue training even when it hurts. Finally, genetic differences can account for how easily bones break or tissues tear while also affecting brain recovery, making an athlete more or less susceptible to injury. This predisposition towards injury can significantly hinder training and end careers. Our genes have a subtle but powerful influence on athletic performance beyond conventional physical attributes. Dominance of Kenyan and Ethiopian long-distance runners Kenya and Ethiopia produce the world's best long-distance runners due to their location on the equator, altitude, specific tribal genetics, and daily running habits. The nilotic body type found in these countries is ideal for long-distance running, while specific tribes have evolved to have thin lower legs, large lungs, and high hemoglobin and red blood cell counts. These abilities can be traced back to their pastoralist ancestors who ran long distances to raid cattle. Running is also a means of escaping poverty, motivating individuals to train hard. Sprinting Dominance, Genetic Evolution at Play West African sprinters and Jamaican sprinters from Trelawney have consistently dominated the track for many years. The secret to their success lies in genetic evolution. West Africans have evolved with specific traits that help their red blood cells become more resilient to malaria, but also result in a higher ratio of fast to slow twitch muscle fibers, perfect for producing explosive force required in short distance running. Meanwhile, Jamaicans from Trelawney have strong, sprinter, genes passed on by their ancestors who managed to escape to the secluded town during slavery. This led to only the fittest and fastest slaves passing on their genes to the elite sprinters of today. The sports gene unravels the remarkable influence of genetics on athletic performance, making it indisputable that having the right genes has a major impact on success in sports. Height, skeletal structure, and muscle composition are just a few of the inherited aspects that offer an advantage in specific disciplines. Furthermore, ancestry, environmental and evolution-driven factors also play a role in creating exceptional athletes. We also learned that our genes even impact subtle aspects like motivation, pain sensitivity, and injury resilience. In summary, the sports gene dismantles the notion that excellence in sports is solely the result of hard work and dedication, revealing the complex and captivating interplay between genetics and the pursuit of greatness.